Hey, what's happening guys? Tyson May here, aka The Naked Traveler, and today as part of the Experience Life magazine cover shoot, I've been asked to extend on my 10,000 push-ups in 10 days charity fundraiser and share with you some tips and pointers on the correct way to do a push-up. Now, why the push-up? Number one, it's free. Two, you can do it anywhere. Three, you don't need any fancy equipment or expensive gym stuff. Four, not only are you pumping up your chest, you're actually engaging a lot of your muscles that you don't even see through your core, shoulders, triceps, even parts of your upper back. So it's a great all round upper body exercise that you can literally do anywhere in the world. Number five, if you really want to, you can do 10,000 in 10 days and raise $10,000 towards a charity of your own. Great way to stay in shape and also do a good deed in the process. All right. Now, there's three things which I think are the most important. And I'm not gonna do 10,000 today, I'm just gonna share, do a few, share with you so you can get you on your, on your way too. All right, so you wanna make sure, so you really wanna make sure that you keep your shoulders, you wanna make sure that your hands are at a shoulder width apart. If you go too wide, you're gonna be putting too much strain on your shoulders as you go down. If you go too narrow, too much emphasis on your triceps and not enough on your chest. So shoulder width apart is the most effective way to really hit everything properly. Else. Number two, and this is very important, you want to keep a straight line from your head all the way down to your ankles. If you start letting, if you start letting your bum sag, you're going to be putting too much strain on your lower back. If you put it up too much, you're not going to be working your core and working the wrong parts of your chest. So keep a nice straight line, really squeeze in your abs and core muscles and then the only thing you have to worry about is keeping your head up and making sure that your chest is the first to hit the ground in a nice steady motion like that now if you want to really put some emphasis on it there are so many different ways that you can really mix it up like the grasshoppers where you lift your knees up to your elbows more of an upper body one Alright, so as you can see guys, pretty simple stuff, something that anyone can do any time of day, anywhere around the world, all you have to do is do it, and like anything guys, consistency really is key, develop a routine, I like to wake up, do 100 every morning, no matter where I am in the world or what I'm doing, so find your own rhythm, find your own routine, and do it, remember to cop that magazine, Experience Life, on issues December 8th, I believe, and stay tuned, I'm going to share some more advanced workouts, as I travel around the world on my next trip, which is a road trip to Perth from Queensland in a few days. Stay tuned, stay healthy, safe travels.